more than any of it. That's right. Because we need to use this con to conduct electricity. What is it wrapped in? That's exactly right. And what is rubber? Insulator. So we have a kind of contradiction here. We have the insulator, yeah, but we also have a conductor. Why is that? That's right. We need the insulator to insulate us away from the electrons that are on here because, as we said, they're going to look for the path of least resistance. And since you're a really good conductor, they're likely to go straight into you and shock you and kill you. This Tell me what you feel. No, just stand right there. Did you oh, feel your hair? Yeah, <laughs> you, you feel the static charge on your hair. Okay, go ahead. Stay, stay clear away from Well, we have to be real careful with this because this is very dangerous. Okay, go ahead and sit down. Okay. And we need everybody to kind of back away. Because now we're going to let Eric know that we had the Van de Graaff generator. Oh, calm down, Eric. Come on. It's not that bad. Come on, what's the matter? Come on. I'm electric, you idiot. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're right. I'm sorry. How do I make this up, Eric? What can I do? Come on. Tell the kids. What do you want me to do? Grab it. Well, I don't want to grab that. I'll grab it, but we're going to have to put you to sleep first. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So, you got to go to bed. Just tell everybody goodbye. Say goodnight, Eric. Good night, Eric. Okay. <laughs> and Eric is right. He is electric, and he shouldn't be around 700,000 volts. But Eric just asked me to do something. What did he ask me to do? I don't know if that's such a good idea. I mean, what do y'all think? Y'all think that's a good idea? Let's, let's look at the logic here. How many volts in this battery, in these double A's? One and a half. One and a half. Now I can touch those without being hurt, right? How many volts in this nine volt battery? Trick question. Nine, that's right. And I can touch that. It doesn't bother me, though. It's not going to kill me. Okay. How many volts are in that wall socket? Would you want to put your finger in that wall socket? No. no. Heart might stop. Could be really bad. It's only 120 volts. Eric wants me to touch 700,000. You think he doesn't like me very much? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's true. That's true. But unfortunately, I did give my word. And since I gave my word, I guess I'm going to have to keep it. Yeah, let's... I got to really... Th yeah, I got to really... I got to really think about this one, you know, for a second. Uh, you know, uh, let me see. Let me, let me try this and see what it looks like at full speed before I go do something really stupid. My hair is jumping up. I don't know. I don't know if I want to touch that. Uh, well, I'll tell you what. I need one of those. Yeah, I need one of these because if I'm going to touch it, I want as much protection as I can get. And somebody might want to open the door. Well, because if I, if I catch fire, I want to be able to get to that bathroom as fast as possible. Okay, I don't care as long as it's got water. <laughs> okay. okay, now, now, where's the fire extinguisher? Oh, Mr. Paul's a fireman. Y'all better know that. Okay, okay, because if, if I catch fire, I want y'all to get that fire extinguisher to Mr. Paul as quick as possible. 
I'm ready. I'm ready. And uh, wait, one more, one more, one more. One more thing. Um, no, no, no. How many of y'all have a, a, a notebook in front of you? All right. Now nah, you in the back, y'all are okay. Y'all are okay. It's just y'all in the front. Now y'all, y'all might want to put it on your head. Yeah. Yeah. That's because. That's because. Go. Hold, that's because if I blow up. Hold it. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Time. That's because if I blow up, y'all don't want Andy guts in your hair. Okay. You don't want Andy guts in your hair. That's why you have that. Just in case, I should explode. All right. Okay, okay, okay. We're, we're pretty much ready. Um, you guys ready? Wow. This is the dumbest thing I've ever done. All right. We're just about ready. Let's get our little discharge wand away from it. <sighs> oh, Donnie, you know where the insurance policy is? All right. Here we go. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm feeling really good here. Let's turn this off for a second. Now I have a lot of electricity in my body right now. You know, what's going to happen when I pull my hand off of you? Nothing. Why not? Because I'm insulated. Now I'm giving it a little time for that charge to get loose and and go off of it so you know that's okay let's let that charge drop we're gonna have to look inside one of these for a nail and then I'll step down and I'll get a little bit of a shock but other than that I'm okay so let's let's try this one more time okay now it's discharged once again I'm not dead now, how many volts are going through my hand? 700,000. That's right. That's, that's exactly right. What will happen if I put my other hand on it? We don't know. Because right now there's 700,000 flowing through my hand. If I'm going to complete a circuit, this could be pretty ugly. Let's see. Absolutely nothing. Why is that? Because you're standing on it. No. How many volts are in this hand? How many volts in this hand? 700,000. How many volts passing through my body? 700,000. In order for that current to be there, it's got to go from a high voltage to a low voltage. But it doesn't. I have the exact same voltage no matter what you do. Ever seen birds on a wire? Why don't they get shot? Same reason. They have the exact same voltage on both feet. The exact same reason that I'm not getting shocked right now. So let's turn this off. We'll discharge it. And we have a couple other experiments because so far all you've seen me do is what? Absolutely nothing. You didn't see me shock, you didn't see me fry, you didn't see me boil, I didn't blow up and get in your hair. So how do you know I'm telling the truth? Because your hair is kind of up. My hair is kind of up, that's right. Well, we're going to do it even better. That's exactly right, because my hair is up, so you know there's a charge going through me. So, 
because Andy kind of has kind of thick hair that doesn't work real well, and he always wanted to be a rock star. Oh yeah, but 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 the school system kind of frowns on people frying kids. I don't know why. <laughs> they just they just don't look very happily on that. So, ah. Andy the rock star is here for a demonstration. Okay. Actually, I want the other hand. Did anything happen to my hair? I can't see. What's happening to it? It's going all over. What? 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 I, what? what are you laughing at? I don't think this is funny. Y'all know Eric. That's what it is. Y'all are good. Y'all been talking to Eric before I got here? No? No? Okay, well, I must just be a funny guy. Wait, 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 wait. Still sticking up? What's going to happen when I let it go? Nope. Why does it still stick up? That's right. Why? And I'm, I'm insulated. That's right. So when I step on that floor, 700,000 volts are coming out of me. And it drops down. So now y'all know I wasn't lying to you. I was telling the truth. 